Hey there, I'm Meredith and I am an intuitive and an astrologer based out of the mountains of North Carolina. And today I just wanted to come talk about Jupiter and how Jupiter, which is the great benefic or like the sort of like lucky expansive influence in astrology is stationing direct. Um, so this is happening on November 23rd. Jupiter has been retrograde since July 28th of this year, and it's stationed retrograde in Aries. So it actually moved into Aries and then, you know, stationed retrograde moved back into Pisces. And, you know, those two Jupiters come with a very different flavor. Jupiter in Aries is like benefits when it preserves itself. It's very much like instinctual. It's like what your physical instincts are and like going with them and focusing on self-preservation and, you know, kind of like advocating for yourself and, you know, the concept of like selfishness and individualism, like not really being a bad thing as much as it is like planetarily supported, you know, when Jupiter is in Aries. So Jupiter moved back into Pisces, October 28th. And, you know, I mean, this kind of like brought in that like incredibly sleepy, very emotional, high level of like hysteria kind of. Um, and, you know, this came on the heels of the eclipse so we've had an eclipse season with jupiter and pisces retrograde and jupiter retrograde is harder be or hard for some people because it's hard to find the light or it's hard to see it's hard to see like what's good about the world and about each other and it's like we have to really like crank up our own internal lantern and like system of like whatever keeps us going um but now jupiter is going to station direct on november 23rd and that's going to really move things forward jupiter tends to drop off a blessing at the end of each sign um you know so i feel like we'll kind of there's a lot of people getting positive karmic payback you know, like there's, a, I'm noticing that a lot of good people that I know are really rightfully receiving what's theirs. And I hope that this is the precedent for Jupiter and Pisces that is to come. Um, but yeah, so I think that it'll be good. It'll really give us the sense finally, especially as there's a couple of aspects that have been very challenging moving off. It'll give us a sense of like, you know, that we're moving forward, uh, you know, that we can see the light, so to speak. So Jupiter is going to move back into Aries December 21st. So really make the most of this like magical, mystical energy while also trying to remain awake. Jupiter in Pisces Station Direct is going to bring like clarity, but while Jupiter is in Pisces, we just want to remember to stay awake, to stay aware, because it's still in very close proximity to Neptune, which is still retrograde until December 3rd. So we just kind of want to stay lucid and stay on top of ourselves and make sure that uh, we're not like acting out of like uh, something that isn't real or like some type of delusion. And um yeah. So yeah, just so have fun and just don't get carried away. And I'm going to make a video as well after this about the new moon. So hopefully you'll check that out. And yeah, thank you. Bye.